Sometimes a documentary photography project will start without you even really realizing that you're doing it. Something's pulled you in. You've been something's touched you. Other things. You know, documentary photography can take can take a long time. It's not something you go out and then you shoot it in three days and you've got your entire photo essay. It takes time. Things have to develop, and there are things. There might be events and other things that happen. So, you know, you got to be a little bit structured. You can do all kinds of different things in the meantime, but you got to know. You're going to know at least some kind of story that you're going to put together. And you, it might change as you go and so forth. But the most important thing is that when you are shooting, it's not just, you know, just taking pictures doesn't make you a photographer in the sense of somebody who's actually really delivering a message and delivering some kind. So what's important with documentary photography is that whatever you're shooting, the story you're doing is something which means something for you. It's something that's coming from your heart, even though you might have planned it out or not planned it out, or more intuitive, more intellectual. It doesn't really matter. It's something, it's a really a story that you want to show, you want to tell, you want to bring people into it. So when I say bringing people into it, you're bringing them along with you into your discovery, into your transformation. Things open up. You see a detail, something open, means something. A vista suddenly opens up, which gives, you know, sets a setting for the thing. Or even a shadow comes up and tells a story of its own. And then maybe at a certain point when you have a body of work that you're happy with and you're ready to, you know, put it together to show, you can publish it. Uh, this, uh, you know, was a big, big book that uh, took me years. But there are other ways of doing it. You can publish an article. You can self-publish on social media, or you can you know, share it in other forms. But the point is that you have a, a, a body of work which, which is like a magic window. It brings people in, and they experience something from an aspect or from, a, from an angle which they've never really thought about before, or which they've never really felt before. So maybe you're asking yourself a question. Why do I want to get to something so seriously? What, it's not about being serious, it's about really experiencing something properly and really experiencing something in a, in a way that is transformative. You're going to be sharing pictures that will transform other people's lives. You too should be transformed by it. And maybe you ask me, why are you a photographer? And I think, I think the main driving thing for me, being a photographer, has always been, it's brought me deeper into my world, it has made me understand my world more. It's kind of like the air I breathe almost, you know, it makes me go.